This one question could change your destiny. Do you have motors or anchors in your life? I have the unique opportunity to work with some incredible people on a regular daily basis. A very specific common theme that I see with the successful people that I work with is they have more motors in their life than they do anchors. But what does that mean? When you think about a motor, a motor is designed to take you places, get you from one spot to another, and then sometimes do it quickly. Whereas an anchor is really designed just to keep you stuck in one place. What I've learned is that the mistake that unsuccessful people make is that they associate themselves with way too many anchors. These anchors are negative, frustrated individuals who bring bad energy into your life and they would much rather see you fail than have success. And they are basically holding you back from reaching your dreams. If you find yourself in a rut and potentially making the same mistakes over and over again, I can almost guarantee you that you have a lot of anchors in your life. So what I recommend you do is take an inventory of all the individuals in your life and determine are they an anchor or are they a motor. If they're an anchor, then you need to start the process of eliminating them from your life as hard as that might be. If they're a motor, then you need to proactively engage with them more often and be more intentional about your relationship with them. I can promise you, you won't be sorry for taking that step.